Advanced networking in Internet 2 is critical to WPI's mission. It's a core capability that's required to meet our strategic plan missions and objectives. For instance, Internet 2 will play a critical role in driving WPI's research and scholarship agenda. It allows better quality, more quantity of research, and broader scope in what we do. About a year ago, WPI obtained an IBM SP, which allows us to do very large-scale computational problems. Medical research being done at WPI includes research to better understand diabetes, to better understand and detect breast cancer, as well as understanding drug interaction and alcoholism. Internet 2 connections allow people to use our machine as part of the computational grid. Internet 2 also allows us to move data very rapidly. What we have here is called a nuclear magnetic resonance spectrometer. Uh, it's commonly referred to as NMR. I foresee that in the future, we could create instrumentation centers which users could access remotely at greatly reduced costs because an instrument like this runs about $400,000. Pfizer had a arthritis drug that they were very interested in developing. Along with that arthritis drug, they had some backup candidates which they wanted to have synthesized and tested. So they uh, talked to WPI about putting a student on the project. I'm involved with an undergraduate fellowship program and the program has existed here at Pfizer for the better part of 12 years. WPI has been a part of this program for all 12 years. Students have been the recipient of, of these awards uh, in every year that we've had the program. Last year, WPI students received three awards. Only four schools um, throughout the country received uh, three awards, and that, that being uh, Stanford, Wisconsin, and the University of Michigan, and WPI. I foresee that the Internet 2 connection will greatly benefit us, particularly in the biochemistry area. I devised a project called the Pet Enzyme Project, and during this project the students work in groups and each group has to select an enzyme from a list that I have generated. The ability to have Internet 2 allows us to use um, much larger proteins. Uh, in the past I've had to restrict the protein size to something that could download relatively rapidly and then be manipulated relatively easily. Um, the ability to have larger bandwidth means that we can use these larger proteins and still keep the download times to a minimum and allow the students to have greater access to a, a larger number of proteins that have been crystallized. Quality of service is really essential for this project to work well. Um, the students have a limited amount of time that they can spend on this because they're taking other classes. Therefore, the time that they spend looking for the data has to be uh, well spent, has to be most efficiently used. So Internet 2 is taking us on a voyage into the unknown. It's taking us to places we can't even today imagine. And these new places will be rich in virtual reality and learning environments that allow us to learn new things and become much more effective at everything that we do.